Today, DMCDDA launches its European Truck Report 2024. The report delivers the latest overview of truck situation in Europe up to 2023, based on data from 29 countries, the EU27, Turkey and Norway. It explores long-term trends and emerging threats in the areas of truck use and supply, and includes analysis on truck-related harms and treatment. As chair of the MCDD Management Board, I commend the high quality of this online publication. It offers innovative ways for audiences to explore and interact with the content, access underlying data and visualize its trends both at European and national level. This is the last European truck report published by the EMCDDA before it becomes the European Union's Trucks Agency, the EUDA, on 2nd of July 2024. Today, I look back over the years and at how the report has evolved. The first annual report on the state of the drugs problem in Europe was published in 1996 and aimed to cover the drugs problem in all its dimensions. With the shift to the European Drug Report in 2013, the emphasis was placed on new trends and developments. Over time, the MCDDA has also adapted its reporting methods to keep pace with the rapidly changing drug landscape, various EU enlargements and evolving information needs in the areas of policy and practice. The agency has provided immense value to its stakeholders by offering an objective assessment of drug-related issues across Europe, coupled with in-depth analysis and discussions on effective interventions. The launch of the European Drug Report 2024 comes at a very special moment, as the agency embarks on a new phase of its history. I am convinced that the UDA will provide even more added value in helping European and national policymakers and professionals working in the drugs fields to tackle the causes and consequences of drug use. I will be very pleased to chair the first meeting of the EUDA Management Board on the 4th and 5th of July in Lisbon. I would like to convey my special thanks to the Director and to all of his staff for his insightful report and for the EMCDDA's many years of comprehensive reporting on the drug situation in Europe. My sincere thanks also go to the national focal points, to the EMCDDA Scientific Committee and all of national and European and international partners who contributed to this analysis. Thank you for your attention.